Now in this part of the question, we're given part of this curve C, which is defined by this parametric equation here, x equals tan theta and y equals sine theta, where theta is greater than or equal to zero, but less than pi upon two radians. Now we have this point P that is on this curve C, P being root three and a half root three. And the question is, find the value of theta at this point P. Now, we can do it in two ways. We can say when x is root three, work out what theta is from this equation, or we could say when y is a half root three, substitute it into here and work out what theta is. Either way, you should get exactly the same answer. I'll do it for taking x to be root three. So if I was setting this out, I'd say when x equals root three, I'd substitute it into here and I would therefore have tan theta equals root three. And I can easily get what theta is by just inverse tan of both sides, inverse tan of root three is what theta is gonna be. And if you do that, I always think of this as giving me 60 degrees, which in radians is pi upon three, pi upon three radians. And there's your answer. Check that it works for your other value. Y equals the sine of pi upon three radians, the equivalent of sine of 60 degrees. And you'll find that is root three over two or a half root three. So it should work either way. Okay, so I hope it's given you an idea then how we'd go about that part.